Hey, what is up, everybody? Jeff again from Sons and Shadows and Zero Point Reviews. I got a brand new box in from a recent sale. Uh, my Black Friday sale from Vinegar Syndrome came in. Here is the uh, sweet box I, uh, I have acquired. And I'm going to go ahead and unbox that and show off what I picked up from this sale. And I like Vinegar Syndrome, but I have also learned the hard way that not every title is wonderful from them, but they put in like great work. So if you have a title you see on their website and you're like, well, I, I would like that. It's kind of pricey. You do get what you pay for. You get great extras. You get a great slip cover. You get a whole bunch of different things that come with it. And so I'm going to go ahead as I'm opening this for the first time with y'all. Yeah, maybe I should keep my little knife out here. Should have been a little more prepared, but that is it. Okay. All right. Ah, first thing I'm opening up is that little red uh, VHS. That's pretty sweet. How does this even open up? I know, I know. I should be a little more prepared. But, ooh, look at that. The light up case with the VHS tapes from Rad. That is a very cool. I'm gonna go ahead and set that over here. And the rest of the and the rest of the order tends to be in like pull out bags. So nice little bubble wrap that's very well packed. We got the prophecy. That is very cool. It's definitely got that little uh, nice little edge. And Kevin, be a jealous bitch. I know you want to get a copy of this too, if you can. That is very cool with Christopher Walken. I like the first one enough. I don't remember the second or third one, but what the hell. And then, of course, Existence, David Cronenberg. I love this movie. When this came out with The Matrix in 99, to be frank with everybody, I like this more than I like The Matrix. Now, I do like the Matrix movie, so don't get me wrong, but I like this movie a lot more than I like the Matrix. Oh, wait, or was it 96? Yeah, somewhere around there. But great little slip cover. Fun book. Can't wait to look into that a little bit better. And a great slip box. It's got a nice texture to it. It feels like... um. A little bit like how the Necronomicon from Ash vs. Evil Dead and the Evil Dead movie should feel like, where it's a bit tough, but I really like that. So that's really, really cool. I'm a big fan of that. This I'm going to be getting into very soon, because my DVD is now sufficiently upgraded. And as well, I can now complete my earlier set with the Cardona Collection. Which, I think that box looks a bit different than this one, actually. This is a little more of a standard little slip box with a nice little pull. It's got indents on each of the thumbs so you can pull this out. So, Oh, and I should watch out for YouTube and their little, their little things on that. I don't... Uh, not too much. No, I don't really see any nudity on there. But the one thing I am noticing is there are circles right here and right here into the box. I'm not really a fan of that indent. I'm not really sure what that's for, but that I am, oh wow, and you can actually see they're kind of up by the logo too. So if you got this collection, I'm not too sure I'm a fan of that. Uh, vinegar syndrome, that should be a smooth case. I'm not sure if that was done on purpose or what, but your Cardona collection part two, Having your little circles be in dense, I'm not sure that's a good look. So I'm not exactly a big fan of that. Hmm. Do better. Fatal Games. I don't know this movie. I have heard lots about it, but I am very excited to check it out. I'm a sucker for slashers. And then... Got my last little set here. Let's get into that. I picked up a couple 
VSA titles. I got Sworn to Justice, Cynthia Rothrock. Rothrock. Uh, those those are some fun movies. I, I love seeing her kick some ass. And then I got The Black Room. I don't know much about this one. I don't actually remember ordering this, to be honest. A little more intact enticement into this family. Man, Larry sees the opportunity when he happens across a newspaper advert for a unique and exotic room to rent in a mansion in the hills. Uh, yeah, this definitely looks like a little bit more of a, a thriller slash horror movie. So I will be watching that soon just to understand what the hell I bought. And of course, I got the Angel movies, of course. I thought I had the box set. I don't know what happened to it. It might be at my my dad's house in storage, but I got Angel. Angel 2, Angel 3, and their slips. And these are beautiful. These are really good. And there's embossing on the, the lower logo. So you got that going. And then on the back, you have some embossing on that as well. Same thing here. And this is a nice little set. I remember watching these movies as a teen. And you can understand why they are now back into the collection. I will rewatch them and we'll go from there. And that is what I got for Vinegar Syndrome. You guys get anything fun from Vinegar Syndrome? You like any of these titles? Got any comments? Got any ideas of what I should watch first? Put that down below. Hit that like button. Hit the little subscribe button and the little bell notification so you can get tuned into all of our content videos. We'd love to talk about movies and film and TV shows and just about video games and just whatever on our channel. So please, thank you for tuning in. We'll see you next time. Make sure you check us out on all of our social media platforms. We got Facebook, Twitter. We are at Suns and Shadows. We're also on Instagram at Suns and Shadows Cast. We are at sunsandshadows.com. Thank you again, everybody, and we'll see you down the road.